Today's video, the worst hotel experience ever. Let me explain. But first, montage.
day of where are we? Rinford, Manila Resort and Casino. I wouldn't really call them a resort. It'd probably be Rinford, Manila Hotel and Casino. If the video looks great, like oh everything looks so beautiful, yeah. Well, it's not. It just looks like the way. First, um, the service. What do you say about the service? Yeah, the service is kind of good. Uh, they're kind. They're welcoming. They're saying good morning, good afternoon, good evening. That's what they do. They're welcoming people. The room. We have the room. It's nice. King size bed. Pillows are great. Bed's great. And uh, lights thing. Some lights don't work. In 1709, the buttons in the toilet don't work. So it's always on. So we couldn't really turn it off. The shower's great too. But the water sp spills out. It floods the area. Not floods. But it shoots out. So your toilet is actually wet and slippery. When you book a hotel here in Winford, you have free breakfast, and what happens in breakfast is always the same. What you eat in breakfast will be the same the next day. One thing to consider, it doesn't taste like anything. Even egg. Egg. No taste. The only thing that will be worth it there is the cereal, and the beef tapa and the sino. But that's it. Everything else, sausage, it tastes bland. The chef doesn't know how to cook. That's what it feels like and tastes like. Refrigerator over there doesn't work doesn't cool anything um, it's like just someone breathing to make it cold it doesn't work the pool the pool best part <laughs> you can't even swim in it if the room's not named after you for example in this situation I buy the room and then my friends stay her friend and then herself what will happen is you go there the person that can only swim is either a child or a guest person for example me I don't want to swim I don't feel like it I feel like my back hurts my leg hurts I can't swim you don't have a choice it's either you swim or you waste that swimming time because they won't allow anyone else to swim except you the one who booked the hotel how does that make sense you booked the hotel so you can choose who to swim I don't want to swim I, I let my friend swim and her friend you know it doesn't make sense. How does that work? You can eat in a ba buffet in their breakfast. Whoever it is, they can eat. As long as they have the room ID name, you're good. You can eat whoever it is. Even I booked it. I don't have to eat. My friends can eat. They can do that. But in swimming pool, I guess swimming pool is more expensive than food. They don't allow you to do that. They don't. They can't. They won't. It's their policy. Then they can't even switch the names of the hotel room to the person who is going to swim. They don't allow you to do that, it's their policy, which is the dumbest policy I've ever heard. Every hotel that I've been in, in a, a real resort, anyone can swim. It's a swimming pool, who cares? It doesn't matter whose name is it under, as long as they're a person, go swim. And the only choice you have for your friend to swim is to pay. And guess what, how much it is? You would wish it's 500 pesos. $26 to swim, 1,475 pesos to swim. What is your pool made out of? Gold? Is your water mineral water? No, it's that expensive. You can even pay less to a water resort, a water pool resort, a water park. You pay less than that. How is that worth it? I would understand if it's like, okay, 200, 400, 500, go ahead, it's fine understandable how does that make sense that's like their that's their policy which doesn't make sense this is probably the worst hotel i've ever been in. and i've been to a lot of hotels that are way better than accommodating uh guests people who have uh less money i guess you know like us so we couldn't swim because only one person could swim because the hotel is not named on me because i can't afford the hotels that's the only thing you can do here swimming or go to the gym and lift weights. There's no spa, there's no uh, massage, there's no salon, they close down. I'm assuming COVID because, you know, that's how it is. Every business closed down. That, that's the only thing we were looking forward to, a pool, and then you can even swim. Only one could. Their food is only great in the casino. Uh, that's the only place that is actually good, but breakfast, not so good. We didn't try the dinner because, you know, it's not free when you order your hotel or book your hotel I'm just being honest it's, it's a terrible experience and the toilet too uh, it isn't clean we went here I saw some black barks 
like like grayish marks on the toilet. I just have to uh, clean it myself. Um, I scraped it with tissue, so kind of gross. Uh, not clean. Really, really gross. Because it's a toilet. That's the most. That's supposed to be the cleanest part. They thoroughly clean because that's where you do your business. So if you if your toilet is not clean, how would I expect that everything else is clean? You know, just my opinion, my experience. That's what I felt here, and that's what I saw here. Good view though, the my seventeen oh nine. Good view from the pool, which you can't even swim in. You just have, you can just look at it. Hope you guys like the video. Leave a like and subscribe. It's free. Support the channel. And thank you for watching. Have a great day. Unlike me. <laughs> Let's see you in the next one. Hope you guys like the video. Leave a like and subscribe. And click that bell button so you get notified when I post another video.